Hey guys, welcome, welcome, welcome. So real quick, I'm just gonna touch base with what I just did. I just did a video for all zodiacs. Cappy, it went Cappy, Virgo, Taurus, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, Sag, Aries, Leo. So basically what I did, okay, and I actually love this spread. It just kind of just came to me, okay? So this is what I did. So say we're dealing with cancer. The first thing I said is, what are my cancers up to? What are they doing, okay? What are my cancers up to? What are they thinking, all right? So as of right now, my cancer thinks, you know, you know, it's love yourself first and then children, all right? And then we got forgiving and lear learning at the bottom. So like, good example, my cancerians right now is like, they have spent so well see this this is a good example because this was not in my cancerian spread so basically what this is telling me this is another group of cancerians where it's like i'm not quite sure but it's like you need to love yourself first you need to put yourself first so your children can come first because a lot of cancerians i will tell you with those motherly instincts your children always come first you what this is saying is put your put yourself first so your children can come first Okay, so, or say you're pregnant or you know your children need more, but they're not getting it from you. It's because you have lack of respect for yourself. Okay, so that, that's a big wake up call for somebody. So basically, I this is for somebody who's dealing with a cancerian. Okay, this is what my cancerian is going through. So then again, I pulled these cards and these are the cards I used. And I basically said, sorry, I just got a lump in my throat. I basically said, this is how they're feeling and this is what they're thinking all right so now we got the hierophant so it's like i'm telling you right now i have a cancerian on my board that's more worried about their relationship than they are with their children or they're not taking care of themselves mentally physically emotionally that they can't get pregnant because they're too focused on making the other person happy see what i'm saying so it's like that's a good example because this is for somebody who knows a cancerian. This is a cancerian's energy right now where it's like even if that cancerian is trying to get pregnant, they can't because it's like they're not nurturing their body. It, they're, they're spending too much emotional time, thought into a relationship, all right, and then temperance. So it's like my cancerian needs patience. They need to heal from a situation because it was reversed. So it's like they're not even healing from a situation. Maybe it's from a relationship. So it's like... It's like, hey, a little bit of a wake-up call. You got children. You got babies to take care of. Please nurture yourself, you know? And it's like, or maybe again, you, you, you know, it's like because you're in such emotional distraught, if that's the case for a cancerian, it's like right now, it's like you're putting all the time and effort into the children. But in all reality, it's like you're not seeing a healing process. You're not healing, you know, because it's like you're not coming first. You're not nurturing yourself. All right, so you get the gist of what I'm doing. And, and I was just, I was doing it a spread like that. And then basically I took these cards and I said to myself, for those dealing with a Cancerian, and if you are a Cancerian, this is your advice too, but for those dealing with a Cancerian, this is your best advice. So if you're the outsider dealing with a Cancerian, your best advice right here would be the four of fire, contentment, peace, abundance, a happy home life, a stress, a stressful comp, comp a, this a successful competition no what contentment peace and abundance a happy home life a successful completion of a project so it's like if you were dealing with cancerian it's not going good it's basically giving this outsider saying listen focus on you focus on your happy focus on your content life because right now something is not going good with that or i'm telling you it could have went the other way around where it's like well not really that's the way I see it because the five of fire is right here. So it's like a bothersome details, conflict with others too. So it's like you're not getting along with this cancerian. You're not seeing eye to eye with this cancerian. So your best advice right here would take care of yourself Why this cancerian tries to figure out how to take care of herself. And if there is children involved, take care of your children. Do what you need to do. But make sure you're also taking care of you. Now, I will tell you, I didn't get any reads where it was... There was a couple where you guys needed to walk away. There was a couple where there was third parties, things like that. But like, this was so different. This was, but this was, this is still reality of a situation. Because I'm telling you, somebody who's dealing with a Cancerian is in that energy right now.
okay? And the universe is basically saying, take care of you. And if there is children involved, you know, obviously tend to the children too, but don't forget about you. So basically they're saying to the outsider, you're doing the right thing. This was a spread, okay? Um, and I will say at the bottom of the deck is forgiving and learning. So it's kind of like now this person wants to forgive or it is they're just in the process of their own karmic trying to heal the family situation. So it's like if you are a Cancerian or you're dealing with a Cancerian and this is your energy, this is major, okay? But I will tell you a good way for you to proceed into... <sighs> I was going to say, get what you need. <laughs> Sorry, music came to my head. But a good way for you to proceed is I'm telling you, take care of yourself. Nurture yourself first. All right? Yeah, your family, your kids, they all need it. And it could be the other way around where you're dealing with the father of a Cancerian. And it's like they're not partaking in the children's life. And it's like you're playing the role. Regardless, healing needs to take place. Regardless, you need to come first. So it was a good example, okay? Um, but that's basically what I just did. The video is now available. You can go to the donation link. It's $10, okay? Um, and it's the only video out there right now for $10. So I, I know exactly which one you're looking for. It is about an hour. It was an hour, 12 minutes, 44 seconds, or an hour. It was something like that. Okay, but um, I actually really enjoyed doing this spread for you guys because it was nice to look at something besides he said, she said. You know, I really dug into the thoughts of what was happening. You know, what what are my Cancerians' thoughts? What are my Cancerians going through? And then I pulled the advice for the cross watcher. And it's still your advice if you're that Cancerian. So I hope that made sense. Um, it was a beautiful spread. I have not um, done a spread like that in a long time. I might continue to do that once a month. And I thought it was important because we did the daily energy today. And it was a beautiful, beautiful spread. And it, it's just it's coming to the end of certain things and, and letting new doors open. So it was just, it was the right time. You know, just have patience on yourself and whomever else you're dealing with. And, and things will go a lot smoother than you think, okay? Um, so... I love you guys. Enjoy the video. And again, um, you can go to the link below, it would say, to benefit our channel and $10, and I will get it to you. And I will tell you, if you don't get it within an hour or two, that means something something happens, okay? So just please email me and say, Cor, I didn't get it. And you'll get it within minutes, okay? Um, I love you guys. Have a fabulous day. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye, guys.